Well, after decades of traditions, a Raytown pizza joint has served up its last pie. The now's Mackenzie Nelson takes a look back at the original Funhouse Pizza and Pub. Yeah, a lot of memories. I spent off and on about 15 years here. If there's one thing Jason Hale knows, it's how to make a pizza. We showed how to make pizzas when I was about five, five or six. Growing up in the family business makes closing down even harder. It's hard seeing a lot of that history go away. But for Jason, the memories will last a lifetime. I met my wife here when she worked here when she, we were younger. The original Funhouse Pizza and Pub in Raytown had three generations of employees, starting with Gary Graham's parents, the original owners. For years, it's just been a family. Family, family run place opening for business back in 1964 back then there wasn't any pizza places in town and we were the first place where you could bring your family after 53 years of serving up a little slice of heaven Gary and his wife Anna decided it was time to retire it's just time for us to kick back and play with the grandkids and do some traveling on December 29th the doors closed on the restaurant customers thought they'd see forever we really just ran out of gas ran out of employees ran out of product now What's left is clearing out. Still trying to shut everything down, get everything cleaned up, and so we can get out of town. So it, it hasn't stopped yet just because the door's closed. Gary says the first thing he's doing is going on vacation. When he gets back, that's when he'll figure out what's next for the building and everything inside. Everybody's got a memory here, and everybody wants to get a piece of it. Reporting in Raytown, I'm Mackenzie Nelson, the Now KC. <laughs> Everybody wants a piece of it, and Gary, the owner, says all of the memorabilia on the walls inside the restaurant he'll give to people in the photos if they wish. Funhouse franchise locations in Lee Summit and Blue Springs, by the way, are still open.